Hello there YouTube, and hello Edge. I am Jensen, and this is Happy's Hungle Book. Happy's Humble Gurgle. This is Happy's Humble. Happy's Humble Burger Barn. If you've ever wanted to live the glamorous dream of being an employee of Burger King, well, you can't. COVID-19 has hit the world, and quite frankly, they're not hiring. Or at least I hope they're not. But this is the next best thing. We are so Got some anime tunes. Okay, perfect. Driving intro, nice. I thought I was supposed to be a humble employee of some kind of Burger King restaurant. Why Why do I have a car? Uh, it must be my mother's. Wonder if I can crash this thing. Yep, yep, does seem like I can crash the car. Okay, so we're here, presumably at work. Then we're gonna get ourselves the world's greatest parking spot. Alright, let's try and back it in. Alright. And look over our shoulder for a good old park. There we go. Nailed it. All employees must clock in upon entering the premises. Happily. <laughs> Happy's Hungle Burger. Happily. This establishment and affiliates accept no responsibility or even liability upon incident, injury, or even death. Only employees and all parties given prior consent are able to enter the premises from this floor. Patrons may enter on the other side of the building. Thank you for your cooperation. Okay. Follow instructions displayed in the top right. Grab my time card and clock in. We can do that. What is this, a guitar? There's a rat in here. Ooh, yeah, I slapped that bass. My skills exceed what is pleasing to the human ear. Yeah, it seems like we've got, we've got some cute bitches. And this is the time clock. Interact with the objects around the environment. Kitchen lights. Perfect. Uh, seems like we've got a freezer. Uh, okay, grab frozen patty from the freezer and throw it on the grill. Put all of these ingredients here, it seems like, onto the preparation surface. Uh, spit in it. And then place the cook patty on the assembly board. Fries. Some salmon nuggets. Ugh, I don't want these. This nearest bin. Ugh, that'll do. Got the lights on, perfect. Uh, we've got a bathroom over here. Wet floor? Nah, we'll open it up to the general public. Got a big heifer over here. What do you want? Do you want milk? No, it doesn't seem like it's that kind of game. Ah, oh, we've got our first customer. Hello there. Welcome to Happy's Humble Burger Barn. I want some salmon nuggets and uh, two soft drinks. Get him some salmon nuggets, some of these foul fish chips. Uh, one toss straight in your mouth, and here you go. Here's the other one. Straight in the mouth it is then, it seems. Okay. So we'll get some of these burgers. Uh, get some pickles. Delicious. Uh, tomato. Delicious. Uh, onion. Uh, I mean, it's okay. And lettuce. Tasteless. Hello there, sir. What can I get for you? One of these burgers, a shake, and some salmon nuggets. Okay. I can do that. Uh, seems like this patty is pretty well done. Toss it on here. Wonderful. And uh, we didn't actually put any sauce on it. Which I think makes it probably one of the worst burgers in the world. Uh, we'll try and find something as a sauce. How about uh, this mop bucket right here? There we go. Perfect. Make it nice and moist for the customer. Ah. Oh, delicious. I would never shop here. Here you are, sir. Oops. Sorry, I nearly dropped it on the ground. Man, the fact that they have no eyebrows is just the creepiest thing, isn't it? Look at this guy. Ugh. It's disturbing. Here is uh, one of the milkshakes. And, of course, some of your disgusting... Where are the salmon nuggets that I had? Here they are. All right, let's toss them in his mouth. Boop. There you go. Enjoy. Please don't come back. I really do not want to keep working here. I'll get another patty on the grill. We're probably going to sell a bunch of them. We'll just make the whole burger, why not? Then we can sauce it up. Some tomatoes, some onion, and some lettuce. In fact, let's get some extra onion. Let's see if the game accepts all of these as, uh, as fillings. Don't worry, sir, I'll get to you in a second. Get some more onion. There we go. Like six onions in there. And a cook patty. Yeah. Uh, he wants a Happy's Deluxe, perfect. Salmon nuggets and some fries. Okay. Fantastic. I can accommodate. Here are your disgusting salmon nuggets. 
Okay, we'll just serve them up. Uh, frozen then, I guess. There you go, there's some frozen chips. Good, sir. In just a second, sir. I need to put some sauce on this bad boy. Looks like there's a couple of urinals here. They'll do. Get them nice and saucy. And I think that's moist enough. Would you like this uh, burger? He'd snatch it right out of my hands with his mouth. What an asshole. At least try and deter anyone from coming back here. Wet floor. No, fuck off, sir. There's a wet floor. You can't come through this door. Sir, you can't come through here. It's a wet... Wet floor. Can't come in here. I just got outsmarted by a... By a bald man wearing a lime shirt. All right, what do you want? You want a soft drink and a shake. All right, here you go. And here is your shake. Enjoy. Oh, he also wants a burger. Okay. Get a patty. And toss this on the uh, on the grill. We'll get a get a burger ready for him. And what do you like, sir? Do you like extra onions? I'm pretty sure you like extra onions, don't you? I mean, how many onions do you think one man wants? All right. And we're not quite done uh, with the onions yet, so we'll just toss that on the ground until we're ready for ready for the patty. Okay. Is this enough onions? No. I, is your mouth watering, sir? I hope it's watering more than my eyes. So otherwise, <laughs> this would not be worth it. Alright, sir. One, my wife is leaving me coming right up. Where's the final ingredient? Here we go. And boom. The perfect burger for the worst man in the world. Here you are. Oh, sorry, sir. It seems as though you've dropped your bag of onions. Yeah, let me pick them up for you. Oh, what a throw. Yeah, it's still the creepiest thing in the world. And now you smell bad, too. What else do you want? A shake? Here you go. All right, we'll take all the trash out. One. Two. Oh, this is hard work. I think I've earned myself a smoke break. All right, and the final one. We'll bin this trash. Number three. And we're good. I didn't close this. Why is it locked? Why is it locked? Ugh. Is that the heifer? I don't want to get too close to him in case he uh, gets lung cancer from me. Ugh. God. Ugh. I hate this cow! Ugh! Where's that light switch? It was in here, wasn't it? Alright. Lobby lights, there we go. Alright, and we're back open for business. Why was this still locked? Oh yeah, that'll do it. That'll definitely do it. We'll continue to manage customers. Let's get some um, patties on the grill. Alright, what do you want, my man? You want some fries? Yeah, enjoy your fries, you big bastard. We'll whack this burger together and we'll try and sauce it up somewhere. Where's the nearest sauce? How about out here? Just. Rub it against the tires of my car. How does that? S oh shit! I've lost it. Okay, got it. There we go. I'll, do, I'll just rub this thing against my tire. I'll leave it. There we go. Perfect. He's getting a freshly sourced up burger. Do you want it, my man? Here you go. Run, you gob. Two burgers. Are you serious? We'll put the sauce on the buns this time. Oh, there's a rat over here. We could sauce it up with this rat. Come here, buddy. All right. I'll rub it on his face. How does that sound? Ugh. All right. I've got a cook patty. Delicious. Freshly greased with this man's natural. Careless sweat. Alright, and the salmon nuggets. Here you go, run your gob. I hate this. I don't know what's outside. Oh, this opens. Have a, have a drink, whatever's outside. Have a drink and leave me alone. Who is it? This is a drive through you need to cut oh, it's, it's happy. The humble, hungry heifer. Hey buddy, what are you hungry? Do you want some delicious, delicious beef? Hmm? 
Wow, this is expensive. 35 bucks for a single burger. Here you go, Happy. Here, have a drink. Ugh. So creepy. Who put the what in the cow? Someone put Happy the Humble Heifer at the yeah, drive-thru. In the middle of the drive-thru. Is this a fucking joke? No, it's not a fucking joke. Take this seriously. Stay put. Stop causing trouble. Now look, I am terribly sorry to say, but your money is not actually any good here. Um, so, let's put this in the bin. Boop. There we go. I don't know if we're going to get punished for this, but... Ooh. Yeah, I found a cassette tape. Toggle. Oh, the door's still blocked. I completely forgot to uh, unjam it. All right, what do you want, you blue-shirted bastard? Just some fries? All right. Here you go. Okay. I don't know if it's better on or off, if I'm completely honest. All right, let's get ourselves a milkshake. Ugh, I, ugh, this is horrible. This really is horrible. The only thing worse than serving these ugly, bald, weird customers is serving them naked. Sir, would can I interest you in a complimentary milkshake? Doesn't seem like it. How about a stale soda? Okay. Okay. Take it. I don't want it. Just take it. All right, we've got this. If it here. What is this? It looks like a warehouse. And what is? I mean, I could go this way. But the wood outside the door frame would uh, tell me that it's not finished. Oh, the cigarettes were a lie as well. Okay, you know what? Just before I go in there, I'm actually going to... Uh, just really quickly... Grab myself a... Yeah, uh, grab myself a hell no. Here you go, my, my dude. Take this. And leave me alone. Oh, hate that. Hate that. Yeah, we'll grab ourselves a uh, milkshake. And we'll gap it out the back. Can we? Fine. We'll go through. Hold up. This... This section of the game has post effects, and this looks really detailed. This facility has been condemned. It is no longer safe for any and all living things. Any and all access beyond this point will be considered trespassing. There is nothing beyond this point worth dying for. It seems 100% fine to me. In the event of an emergency, follow the evacuation route. Some, some lockers here. And a bench. And what looks like a uh, tablecloth from a child's birthday party. Something coming, coming to jump at, jump out at me. What's gonna jump out at me? No, just seems like we've got customers. Hungry, hungry, glitchy, weird customers. Yeah, this is so strange. Cause, in case you haven't noticed, these guys still have the same strange post effects as was in Happy's humble burger bun. While these are incredibly well detailed. Genetic technology, wing 13. Ah, so there's these guys, and there's also this dead guy down here. And if I'm completely honest, I would probably say that this dead guy needs this milkshake far more than I do. Is this an elevator? Man, this is groovy. This is so groovy. 
vs Redocument. Simulation scenarios, a brief rundown of current running simulations. Wage Slave, the one I assumed that we were in. Location, Happy's Humble Burger Barn. Low wage fast food worker, living paycheck to paycheck. Methods, audio plus visual brain entertainment. Trauma based climax, light drugging. I, I imagine the drugs were in the cigarettes. Uh, then there's the lifesaver. Location, Maple Overlook Hospital, premise, nurse's aid, janitor, methods, continual trauma, medium drugging. Interesting. Sorry, I should probably be looking out these windows, shouldn't I? Guess I missed something. Am I gonna be jump scared? You'd probably need heavy drugs to be a, a grave digger if I'm completely honest. Uh, it's probably not a job for me. Can I throw this? Yeah, of course I can. Perfect. So I wonder if there's going to be anything else that I can uh, see around here. Ah! In between these two rather penis looking statues seems to be a giant uh, breasted woman. Man, there's so much to look at! Oops, and I've just walked into not only a penis but also uh, another wall. I have no idea what I am looking at. This is so cool. There's a tree for some weird reason. And I'm pretty sure the man I thought was a man is actually a painting. There's a uh, video camera here too. Gonna see. Okay, what about, what's this? The Cheese Maze Initiative. In this series of experiments, we will attempt to influence or control the minds of our test subjects through themed auditory and visual cues. Each test subject is placed into a customized scenario and subjected to several cycles of therapy and programming. The therapy and programming normalizes the scenario and embeds deep mental triggers. When a subject is released back into the wild, they can now be triggered into a subservient state. A constant state of hypnosis is not a desirable outcome. A so-called sleeper state of hypnosis that can be activated via verbal, audio or visual cues is ideal. Triggers can include a frequency emitted through radios and cellular devices, or images broadcast on television and computer screens. Herding the sheep, as Dr. Grimm himself put it. Is this Grimm? Is this Dr. Grimm? In the last paragraph, it specifies that this uh, frequency can be emitted on computer screens. So, it is definitely breaking the fourth wall. You can read the rest of this for yourself. Um, it seems like an investigative journal journalist century. So we've got... I'm pretty sure that this is the conference room. Approximately three hours after sunrise, an accident at a military facility located on the outcast islands resulted in a nuclear explosion. I have a sneaky suspicion that this game is just going to, um, uh, uh, uh throw a jump scare at me. Somewhere. Can I open this door? No. So, I think what I'm, uh, looking at now is, uh, on the map, the office complex. If I go back to that map. Yeah, so the office wing was this area. This must be the exit then. I mean, there's a, there's a, uh, what looks like a bare chest tape in his hand. Oh my god! He got toasted! Sorry, I, I'm also just like realizing that there's a door right here um, with a window on it that I can't see through, despite the fact that like a meter away is another open door. This it, door doesn't exist on the side though. So. Ugh! There's a tape player here too. We'll take this tape. What do we do? Throw it in? Oh, ridiculous. What, that's it? Just fade to black? Oh! That was really, really good. I was not expecting the turn that they gave. It just, it just goes to show that everything happened because we were lightly drugged. <sighs> oh, thank God. Okay, so the objective does say manage customers forever, endless mode. Hello? What do you want? A soft drink and some fries. Well, here you go, here's your soft drink. 
My mistake, sir. It seems as though that was our rock hard milkshake. Oh, it is another rock hard milkshake. What was happening was people were doing experiments to see if we could um, outlast the nuclear fallout of everything that was happening. And I, th I think that's why we were here. I also just realized that uh, we are a fry cook in the game um, and we, uh, the player, are the people who are being hypnotically inducted into this. Now oh, this guy wants some fries as well. No, oh, these are salmon nuggets, aren't they? Are they gonna ding his ride? Some pretty solid nuggets, I gotta say. He wants me to shake! Yeah, here we go. Do you want me to shake it? For a tip, I'll back it up onto you, my good sir. Here you go, you creepy bastard. Yeah, bump and grind. That's how I make my dollars. I'm not, I'm really not paid enough here. <laughs> and what was the other one? Fries, right? No soft drink. Here you go. Oh, terribly sorry. Yeah, it really does seem like endless mode, doesn't it? What is this? There's some guy in my pickup truck. This guy stole my ride. Excuse me. That's my truck. Oh wow, there's a lot of food out here. What is he? What, what do you think he wants? A shake? Nope. Don't think he wants a shake. Does he want some salmon nuggets? Nope. <laughs> okay. I I know there is a vending machine out there for like roleplay purposes, but why wouldn't I just get a free soda from here? I work here. Do you want a soda, sir? Pickles, a wad of cash, and a burger bun. What is this? Here's your burger. Piss off. Can I microwave the money? What is the point of this? <laughs> Alright, here have some salmon nuggets. Some fries. Perfect. Alright, I'm going home. I took his money. I'm off. Can I lick this? I'm just gonna have a quick look around just to make sure that I haven't missed anything. This isn't just where they spawn, is it? God, what is this congregation of bald people? This is terrifying. I hope I'm not walking in on them breeding. Hey, what's this? Dear CJU Gams, you are the best video maker in the world. Me and my friends really like your videos a lot. We believe you can do anything and you are really smart. Love, Suvi Susie Devin Thomas. P.S. I drew you a flat word. How sweet is that? I think we've seen pretty much everything there is to see. So, that is it from me today. If you like what I'm doing, consider leaving a like, maybe even subscribing to my channel. I'm going to keep putting out videos whether you like it or not. And until the next one, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. God, I'm not going to miss these guys.